Hey everyone welcome back to my After Effects tutorial. Thanks for subscribing and liking my video. I was hoping we can get 5000 likes for this video. Today we are going to create this. Also I made it like a template so you can download the project file and replace with your own logo. I will allow using this template for personal use not for commercial use. Let's start the tutorial. Open After Effects. Make a new composition by 500 pixels by 500 pixels. And set the duration to 10 second long for now. This composition will be used for the logo. Drag the logo into this composition and scale until it's fit on the composition. Make another composition and call this main and set it full HD 1080 and set the duration to 10 second long for now. Let me quickly organize my folder structure so the project looks clean and organized. Now drag the logo composition into main composition. Let me make a background for the main composition. You can follow this way to make smooth background or you can use gradient ramp effect. Background is ready now. Pre-compose the layers for background. It looks good for me. Now draw some guidelines around the logo composition. Select the pen tool. and start drawing from right to left, in this way. I will speed up this part, so the tutorial will not be too long. I will remove the guidelines now. We don't need these anymore. Now apply stroke effect on the logo composition. And adjust few parameters. Change the brush size until it covers the entire logo composition. Brush hardness to 100% and spacing to 0%. Now change the end value to 0% dot and make a keyframe at the beginning. Go to 30 frame forward and change end value to 100%. Let's take a ramp preview. Perfect. Change the opacity to 50%. Now duplicate the logo composition and move it to one frame forward. Duplicate again and move it to one frame forward. 
and set the opacity to 100%. Now add some stylization to the logo. Make a new adjustment layer and call it line. Select pen tool and make some random path in that way. Apply 3D stroke to the adjustment layer. Let me hide the logo compositions for now and drag another copy from the project panel. Click on this little icon and the black background will disappear. And make the opacity 10% so we can see the reference of our logo. Let's continue working on the adjustment layer. Go the effect controller and change some parameters. Open taper and enable it. Change the end value to 0% and add a keyframe. Go few frames forward and set end value to 100%. Now come back few frames and set the start value to 0%. Go few frames forward and set start value to 100%. And we are done for the 3D stroke effect. Let's add rough and edges effect to the adjustment layer. And change border to 16. Play with edge sharpness and complexity to get desire look. Now I will add a little expression to the evolution. Hold the Alt key and left click dot now type time 100. And you are done with adjustment layer. Now let's duplicate adjustment layer and delete the mask and draw new mask by using pen tool. Now repeat the same process and make more copies. I will speed up this part. So the tutorial will not be too long. Now change the stroke color and pick from the logo that you are using. Let's move the layers and timeline to make some random effect. Let's duplicate these all layers and make move in time. that's look good to me. I will also color code the layers so I can understand and select easily. Let's hide all the adjustment layers.
make another adjustment layer and call this glow. Apply glow effect to the adjustment layer. Open opacity and add keyframe at 0%. Go one frame forward and add keyframe at 100%. Copy and paste these keyframes a couple of times. Select all keyframes and right-click on any keyframe, and set to toggle hold keyframe. And we are done. Thanks for watching this tutorial. If you like please hit the like button and consider subscribing. So I can continue making videos like this. Until next time have fun and keep growing.